Hi guys, welcome back to Saptic TV. I have received several queries related with using DroidCam app with Google Meet. And that is the motivation behind creating this video. Please watch my video on using DroidCam with Zoom and Skype apps if you haven't watched it. I have provided links at the upper right corner as well as at the description section of this video. In that video, the features of DroidCam app is completely dealt with in detail. So let's get started. Now let me launch the DroidCam app installed in my smartphone. Now it's showing the IP address of the phone and this IP address should be given at the DroidCam client installed on my computer. While using DroidCam, I have a product recommendation for you. It will be better if you use a phone tripod like this because you will be able to comfortably mount the phone in this tripod and keep it on a convenient position. And using this icon on top, you will be able to choose the desired camera of the phone. You can choose front or back. I'll choose back. Now I load the DroidCam client app in my computer. Then I'll give the same IP address as that of the phone there. Now you can see that app is connected with the phone camera. Now I'll click on the rotate icon to correct the orientation. Now let's see how to use Droid Cam with Google Meet. I have opened Google Chrome browser. Now I'll click on the Google Apps icon at the upper right corner. Then here I have Meet option available. Just click on that. Now here you have given options to start a new meeting or you can enter an existing meeting by entering a code. So I'll click on new meeting. Here I have options to create a meeting or later or I can start an instant meeting. I'll click on start an instant meeting. Now you can see the camera is starting and this camera is the camera of my laptop. Now you can see the lighting and you can see the resolution. Next, I'll change the camera to Droid Cam. Let's see the procedure. I'll click on these three vertical dots at the upper right corner. Then I'll click on settings. Here I have options to change the audio setting. That is the microphone I can change if I want from the existing microphone of my computer to the Droid Cam microphone, which is the microphone of my smartphone. I don't want to do that. I'll click on video and here I can change my camera from Lenovo Easy Camera which is the camera of my laptop to the Droid Cam source 2 or 3. I've got two sources of Droid Cam available here because I haven't connected Droid Cam with any other apps. You can click on any of the sources. I'll click on source 2. Now you can see that I'm connected to the Droid Cam and I'll close this. Now here you can see the change in resolution. By all means, this is a better option than the default camera of my laptop, right? Even when you join a meet, the procedure is the same. You can just click on the three dots at the lower right corner and you can click on settings. There you will get the same option to specify the audio as well as the video. You can click on the video. Under the camera, you can choose the Droid Cam. I'll select Droid Cam Source 3 and I can also choose the send resolution and receive resolution. If you want high resolution video, you can select 720p at the send and receive resolutions. That is the HD resolution. Now I'll close the settings interface. So this is how you use Droid Cam in Google Meet. Hope the procedure is clear. So that's all for now. Until I catch you with another informative video, Bye-bye and take care. Thank you so much. Please don't forget to subscribe to Saptic TV for such informative videos on technology.